Okay, we have some uh, work to do today. I'm going to be doing some flooring inside of the tiny house. And it's pretty cold out. We're into November weather now. Uh, late November, almost December. So the weather is getting quite chilly. So rather than work in the cold all day, we're going to get a little wood fire going here. I did preload it, but I'm just going to back it out a little bit. Get a little bit of a fire going so that it can generate some heat. Artemis does not like super cold weather. As soon as she came outside, she had her pop. You know, it's not even into the cold part of the winter, but she's already having some issues. So I'll, uh, I'll allow it and uh, let it fire. Heat going in here, and get to our floor. So we have about one, two, three, four, almost five rows of the shiplap. Uh, shiplap. I've got shiplap on the brain. We've been doing so much shiplap work over the last couple months. Not really, but uh, we've been doing enough that it's in there. Under the flooring, this paneling, it's plastic flooring. It's the same stuff that we use uh, inside of our uh, our house, uh, inside of our entryway. It's plastic. It's held up amazingly well over years. It's not like laminate where it's going to peel off. Uh, it's been very sturdy, so uh, we saw this stuff and wanted to go with it again. This stuff's very easy to work with. When you're uh, placing it down, uh, you just need a mallet and to cut. And it's the same principle as cutting shiplap, you know, you only ever want to cut one side uh, because you can't join it. There's specific things here at the corner that you can see uh, that are designed to fit in so that the corners fit and it's designed so that this edge is tapered properly for where it joins with right here. And so they fit together pretty well perfectly. And then you just need a mallet to hammer them in place. It can be a little bit difficult to get these things to align if you don't have a good join or, or if it's off somewhere or if there's a little bit of warp. But I find that pressing down hard on the flooring when you're installing it really helps with getting a good join and uh, doing the same when you're hammering. Because the flooring is, it's the whole subflooring underneath here, it's not that much. So we're taking our lumps where we can far as the flooring and beam level and hopefully the laminate will be able to not be too floppy. Right arms? That's not too loud for your ears, is it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And as I mentioned, you can see it's sort of floppy, but as it starts to have panels on both sides, it gets uh, less floppy. So you know, I think that's just how this stuff sort of works. I've never worked with a, as large an area with this stuff before, so we'll see how it turns out. Offset it so you don't have all the joints at one place. It felt thicker, as if it was adapting in response to the facts they faced. The fibers on her chest and forearms in particular seemed harder, more robust. The 
responsiveness of it you continue to press it. Now you can help me with this, Eno. I'm here because Falcone insisted, but Sparrow cocked her head. Do you know what the military does? I have people who just as soon cut your throat as shake your hand. Let's go. Come on, let's go. RD, it's time to get up. Come on, dude. Aren't you? Okay, well, we are, we might be in a little bit of trouble here. I'm a little bit worried just due to the fact that we have two boxes of uh, flooring left, and just this left. Uh, it's only, I'm hoping it's only going to be three rows, but we're cutting it pretty short here. Cutting pretty tight, I guess I should say, instead of short. We might have cut it short, and as a result, it might be a tight fit. We're in a tight spot here. Yeah, we, I mean, I think we're going to be okay. I don't want to panic, but uh, it's getting very close to being done. And now that, uh, you know, I'm cruising along at a good speed, I'm worried, and uh, this stuff we bought discounted, so I'm not even sure if we get more, so I might have to do some creative thinking if we do run out, but it looks great. It's going together pretty quick, so I'm excited to be done. little piece. It's getting dark, so I'll say four and a half. 